Welcome to this EndNotes tutorial. In this video, you will learn the steps of adding references from OneSearch. Before we start, make sure you are using Chrome or Firefox as your browser. This will make sure you download the references from OneSearch successfully. First we will show you how to download reference from OneSearch. Let's go to library homepage to get OneSearch. OneSearch is the library's one-stop discovery platform, to let you find various research materials we have in the library. Now let's start a simple search with a topic we are interested in. For this example, we are using virtual reality healthcare. Then click search. Let's say we want to download the reference of the first article to EndNote. Click on the article red cord to open it. Then under Send to, you will find the icon named as EndNote, RIS. Click the icon to download the reference. Then simply click Download. The RIS file extension is a file format that is readable by EndNote. The option is available in most databases as well which allowing users to export references from their platforms to EndNote. Next, we will demonstrate how to import the RIS file to EndNote. By default, the RIS file you downloaded should be located in your Downloads folder. Double-click the RIS file. The reference will then be imported into your reference library. The newly imported reference will be listed temporarily under Imported References folder and can also be viewed under All References. For most references you imported, you will read the citation information including Authors Source Publication Year, etc. Full text PDF is not automatically included in the reference. If you want to read the PDF in EndNote, you have to download the PDF separately and attach it to the reference. To learn how to attach it, you can follow the steps introduced in our EndNote guide. If you have any questions, please contact your faculty librarians.